Hello, everyone. Oh, hello. Hello. <laughs> Everybody, this is Rita, my mom. Um, she's often been joining us with worship. Do you want to just um, silence your phone? Sure. Um, yeah, so she's often joined us virtually, and now tonight she's here in person, in the flesh, so to speak. So she's going to read the psalm, and uh, don't tell Tessa, but I'm going to let her read a really short psalm tonight. Psalm for tonight is Psalm number 124, and uh, we'll sing for our hymn, uh, hymn number 632, O God, our help in ages past. And uh, yeah, should be good. Welcome Rose and Dave. Hey, Joanne. Welcome to you and Ron from Australia. Blessings, Robin. Good to see you. Uh, Carrie and Curtis, peace to you tonight. Hey, Dan, thanks for joining in. Katika, blessings to you. So let's, uh, let's get started. As it is good and wise to begin all things under the care of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Oh, Karen, it is in fact my mom. Yes. In fact, we're selling raffle tickets. If you'd like to join live and in person for, for COVID Compline, Oh, I almost forgot. Tonight is our 150th uh, Compline oh, service wow. during this COVID time. It's wow. crazy. Yeah. And I just checked today. We're, uh, I think I said this the other night, but for sure we're over $13,000 that we've raised for charities, various charities um, during awesome. these, this time. So yeah, that's super encouraging. Generous people. Thanks, Karen. I need to wear my mask that you sent me one of these nights. Karen sent me a, a, Rough, Riders a Rough Riders mask. mask. It's a really good one too. Perfect. Has the uh, has the insertable um, oh, filter. Filter, yeah. There we go. That's the word I was looking for. Compline 150. So I think I feel like we need to. Um, I mapped out today uh, because we're five days a week now instead of seven. Our 200th episode or service will fall in uh, early November. I think. No, like November, right around Remembrance Day. And uh, so I'd be interested to hear from y'all if you would be game for another uh, fundraising challenge or if we've done that and you're, um, that's not life-giving anymore, um, absolutely we can go and uh, find some other things to do. But uh, if that would be something you'd be interested in and uh, start lifting up another wave of um, issues that are... Um, tweaking on your hearts and uh, uh, charities that you appreciate and would love to support in this time, we would, uh, I'd be very interested to hear that. Yes, Scott Mo. Um, yeah, well, you should probably listen to your premier. But, you know, we could also, um, you know, if you win the raffle, you, you wouldn't have to come right away. You could always come for the uh, 2000th episode of Compline. <laughs> we don't like, we've started this now. We, how are we ever going to stop? Yes, he suggests. Yeah, that's very true. Well, good to see that people are in a chatty mood tonight. Hey, Tyler, good to see you. This is a family affair tonight. My cousins are here. And hi, Jean. Blessings to you. Great to have you aboard tonight. Joe, blessings to you and Barb. Awesome. So um, I have a, and Lindsay, welcome. Thanks for joining in tonight. I see all kinds of people tonight, that's awesome. So a uh, prayer this evening from Martin Luther. Behold, Lord, an empty vessel that needs to be filled. My Lord, fill it. I am weak in the faith, strengthen me. I am cold in love, warm me and make me fervent, that my love may go out to my neighbor. I do not have a strong and firm faith at times I doubt and, and am unable to trust you altogether. O oh Lord, help me. Strengthen my faith and trust in you. In you I have sealed the treasure of all that I have. I am poor, you are rich, and you have come to be merciful to the poor. I am a sinner, you are upright. 
With me, there is an abundance of sin. In you is the fullness of righteousness. Therefore, I will remain with you, of whom I can receive, but to whom I may not give. Amen. Well, let's begin. Almighty God, grant us a quiet night and peace at the last. Amen. It is good to give thanks to the Lord, to sing praise to your name, O Most High, to herald you your love in the morning, your truth at the close of the day. Friends, let us confess our sin in the presence of God and of one another. So I'll read first, and then you can bless, okay. and then you read, and I'll bless. Okay. I confess to God Almighty before the whole company of heaven and to you, my brothers and sisters, that I have sinned by my own fault in thought, word, and deed. I pray God Almighty to have mercy on me. Forgive me all my sins and bring me to everlasting life. Almighty and merciful God, grant you healing, pardon, and forgiveness of all your sins. Amen. Amen. I confess to God Almighty before the whole company of heaven and to you, my brothers and sisters, that I have sinned by my own fault in thought, word, and deed. I pray God Almighty to have mercy on me, forgive me all my sins, and bring me everlasting life. Almighty and merciful God, grant you healing, pardon, and forgiveness for all your sins. Amen. Amen. Psalm 124. If the Lord had not been on our side, let Israel now say. If the Lord had not been on our side when enemies rose up against us, then would they have swallowed us up alive in their fierce anger toward us. Then would the waters have overwhelmed us and the torrent gone over us. Then would the raging waters have gone right over us. Blessed be the Lord who has not given us over to be a prey for their teeth. We have escaped like a bird from the snare of the fowler. The snare is broken and we have escaped. Our help is in the name of the Lord, the maker of heaven and earth. So our hymn again tonight is, our, O God, Our Help in Ages Past. Maybe we can see this together. Yeah. It's not the most light in here either, so you hold that side. Yeah. So the tune um, goes like this. you are 
God to endless years the same. Do you know this hymn? No. <laughs> <laughs> it's apparent. <laughs> Should we choose one that you know? <laughs> no, that's okay. You continue on and I'll just hum. It's one of those ones that's a bit um, counterintuitive the way it yeah. goes. Um, so the fourth verse goes, let me sing the fourth and then join me in for the fifth. A thousand eight, a thousand ages in your sight are like an evening gone. Short as the watch that ends the night before the rising sun. I don't know if I can actually sing the fifth verse without the, <laughs> without the, music, without yeah. the music right there. Let's just stop there then. Let's stop there. <laughs> The sixth line of mm. just well that was an adventure right? yes it was thank you yes mm -hmm. thank <laughs> <you>. <laughs> we don't we make no uh we make no claims no to warranty musical of musical professional yeah. yes exactly this is we're about participation not uh, perfection here i'm glad that you know it um joanne you know what she was doing just fine that's right. Some of these older hymns I've only really learned through um, going to the mm -hmm. care homes and yeah. singing hymn sings with people. And, yeah. and it's just amazing to watch people kind of light up um, for the hymns mm -hmm. that they recognize. And it's yeah. different for everybody, right? But the hymns yeah. that really like Resonate. hit home for them, they yeah. tweak them to a, a memory or a particular mm -hmm. place or time. Or, yeah. yeah. So, do you want to choose a couple of those um, verselets? You want me to just You'll read recognize it? a few of them, yeah. Okay. Just tell us what you're reading the... Um, oh, the name? Okay. Yeah. So you want me to read two? Sure. Okay, reading from Matthew 6. Do not worry saying, what will we eat, or what will we drink, or what will we wear? Indeed, your Heavenly Father knows that you need all these things. But strive first for the dominion and the righteousness of God, and all these things will be given to you as well. So do not worry about tomorrow. And from Romans 8, I am convinced that neither death, nor life, nor angels, nor rulers, nor things present, nor things to come, nor powers, nor heights, nor depth, nor anything else in all creation will be able to separate us from the love of God in Christ Jesus our Lord. Amen. Thank you. You're welcome. So let's sing our responsory, and your part goes, Into your hands I commend my spirit. Into your hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit. Into your hands I commend my spirit. You have redeemed me, O Lord God of truth. Into your hands I commend my spirit. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. Into your hands I commend my spirit. Well, that was lovely, if I yes, do say much so myself. Better. It's, uh, it's amazing if you actually sing stuff that you've practiced, yeah, you right? Yeah, know, know the tune, even. Yeah. yeah. 
it's and it's so nice for me to um to sing with somebody else mm -hmm. um like i trust that you're all singing across the internet but i can't I hear, hear you, you and it's a very yeah. different thing mm -hmm. um and then tessa god bless her heart has joined me several times but singing is not really her her thing first choice to yeah. well i mean if get her an 80s pop and she'll sing all day mm -hmm. but liturgical music is not in her repertoire right now so the gospel canticle guide us waking o lord and guard us sleeping that awake we may watch with christ and asleep we may rest in peace. Now, Lord, you let your servant go in peace. Your word has been fulfilled. My own eyes have seen the salvation which you have prepared in the sight of every people. A light to reveal you to the nations and the glory of your people Israel. Guide us waiting, O Lord, and guard us sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ and asleep we may rest in peace. Friends, for what and for whom shall we pray this night? Thanks for joining us, Pam and Marlo. Rose is impressed with your harmonies. We got, she says we got a place for you in the band. Oh, at in our the band. Mm. Uh, so I will, um, once we sing this, I'll hand this to you and you can choose at your leisure some of these prayer themes, maybe three or four. Okay. okay. Hear my prayer, O Lord, listen to my cry. Keep me as the apple of your eye. Hide me in the shadow of your wings. In righteousness I shall see you. When I awake, your presence will give me joy. We pray tonight, O oh God, giving thanks for the great privilege it is to sit before you and know that you attend to our prayers, hearing our laments, enduring our uh, angry complaints, waiting with us, weeping with us. You receive uh, our thanksgiving as praise and we delight in this time to draw nearer to your heart, Lord. We pray as we uh, offer these prayer intentions, these petitions, we pray that you would grant us the grace uh, of hearing from you. Minister to us through your Holy Spirit. Lead us into better and deeper discernment of your will and your ways for us as we endeavor to be your people in these places, in these challenging times. We pray tonight together with Karen, for Blair and Lindsay, preparing to be married this Saturday. Lord, we give thanks uh, for such times of celebration. Uh, we lift up to you Solomon's birthday this week these opportunities to welcome new children, to celebrate birthdays, anniversaries, new weddings, even though our celebrations don't uh, look the way they once did or we, the way we long for them to be again, Lord. It is so good 
to have these signs of your defiant love and life uh, that will not be snuffed out, uh, covered up or buried for long. We pray tonight with Heidi for Papa Howie. Lord, who you know continues to struggle uh, with chronic, um, with chronic pain related to his uh, stroke. We pray giving thanks for the friends and family who continue to surround and support him. And pray, Lord, that you will work through them to buoy him up. We pray that you would minister to him in his pain in the way that only you can, even as you make providence for faithful doctors, nurses, pharmacists, and caregivers. And we give thanks with Heidi for the friends and family who gathered around her to support her uh, through uh, a difficult period of, of so many struggles and challenges. Lord, we pray tonight with Joanne and all our brothers and sisters in the Southern Hemisphere and in Australia in particular. We pray with Joanne uh, for COVID-19 numbers to keep dropping in Victoria. Lord, we pray that you would give the people patience and endurance and forbearance as they continue in lockdown, awaiting news on Sunday uh, as to whether restrictions will be eased. We pray for uh, kids and those who gather around them to support them as they uh, continue in remote learning with all the challenges that that presents. Lord, we lift up to you especially uh, anywhere in all the places where remote learning is happening. We lift up to you those families and, and children in particular who, for a variety of reasons, don't have the same access to high-speed internet uh, or electronic devices as do many or most. We pray, Lord, that you would give us your compassion for the poor lest they be left behind or further marginalized during this time. Go ahead. Oh God, it is your will to hold both heaven and earth in a single piece. Let the design of your great love shine on the waste of our wraths and sorrows and give peace to your church peace amongst nations, peace in our homes, and peace in our hearts through your Son, Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Mm. Lord, we pray tonight with Robin for all those families with children wishing to be learning through distributed learning and are now on wait lists for schools and openings. We pray with Karen, continuing to pray for the staff and residents of Bethsaida Place in Steinbach. Uh, as more deaths are reported and occur, more effect and infections are on the rise. We pray especially uh, that Phyllis Engel's mom will remain under your um, protection and remain healthy. Lord, we lift up to you through uh, the specific people of Bethsaida Place, all our elders, especially those in care facilities. We pray uh, for great attention to detail and faithfulness on behalf of their staff uh, and nurses and cleaners and administrators Lord, work through your people to keep uh, 
uh, those most vulnerable to, to COVID-19 uh, safe. Mm -hmm. God, our refuge and strength, you have bound us together in a common life. In all our conflicts, help us to confront one another without hatred or bitterness, to listen to your voice and competing claims and to work together with mutual forbearance and respect through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. Lord, we give thanks together with Dan. Uh, and Dan, I hope that I'm, I'm getting this right. Get, give thanks with Dan for W and give thanks for the effectiveness of the chemo that has reduced the cancerous lesions. Lord, we give you thanks for every bit of healing, of relief, of mercy, of wholeness uh, that comes to bear and comes to pass through your uh, wonderful action, through your uh, desire to make whole and to recreate all of your creation. Uh, we give thanks for your healing, whether it comes little by little or all at once, and we, uh, we pray for faithfulness to continue to watch full of hope for that healing to come uh, in every person and in every place where it is so longed for and desired. We lift up to you, O oh Lord, together with Madeleine and her siblings, with Carrie and her siblings, uh, their respective parents and uh, step-parents. We pray especially for Rosanna, that she will have uh, a sense of being at home, a sense of peace, uh, a sense of familiarity in the midst of her increasing dementia. We pray that, we pray for, uh, all families, Lord, navigating the process of helping elders to um, navigate from home into uh, facilities that can meet their levels of care required. We pray uh, that at such stressful times, you would let your presence be known through a sense of peace and unity amidst uh, difficult decisions, especially when not everyone always agrees on initially on all the uh, on everything needed god our creator you have ordered seed time and harvest sunshine and rain give to all who work the land fair compensation for the work of their hands grant that the people of this and every nation may give thanks to you for food drink and all that sustains life May, may use with care the land. May use with care the land and water from which these good things come, and may honor the laborers who produce them through your Son Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Amen. We give thanks together with uh, the Almer family, with Carrie and all her siblings, for the return from hospital of her dad, and uh, and for the improvement and healing that we're seeing. Be present, merciful God, and protect us through the hours of this night, so that we who are wearied by the changes and chances of life may find our rest in you, through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. I just want to, um, as we hold this hymnal together, I just want to offer another word of thanks and praise, O oh God, for uh, those who go before us in the faith and mentor us. Um, I just can see so many uh, Sunday mornings spent in pews with uh, so many other aunts and uncles um, and other just uh, church friends holding hymnals with us and showing us how to navigate the liturgy and 
not just putting up with, but delighting in our giggles and, and playfulness as we're raised in such a space of grace. Give thanks, Lord, for the gentle way in which you imbue us with uh, this faith and in which you transmit it. We pray for faithfulness, Lord, to do our own turn with the generations to come, to help them come to know you through your scriptures, through our mutual prayers, through our uh, singing, through our laughter and tears. Gracious God, we give you thanks for the day, especially for the good we were permitted to give and to receive. The day is now past, and we commit it to you. We entrust to you the night, and we rest securely, for you are our help. And you neither slumber nor sleep, through Jesus Christ our Lord, who teaches us to pray. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread. Forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Save us from the time of trial, and deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Amen. Let us bless the Lord. Thanks be to God, almighty and merciful God, who is Father and Son and Holy Spirit. Bless, preserve, and keep us this night and forevermore. Amen. Good night, friends. Thanks for joining us, and uh, thanks be to God for the opportunity to close our day in this way. So whether you've had a, an easy day or a hard day, whether you've had a wonderful day or a rotten one, rejoice that it is done. Rest now in God's peace and love that you might rise to be full of faith and of good service tomorrow. Good night. Peace to be with you. Good night. <laughs> good night. Good night, Carrie. Good night, Curtis. Good night, Heidi and Clovis and all your menagerie. Good night, Karen. Karen wants to know if you'll be back tomorrow. Probably not, but Probably maybe not. another time soon enough. I have to practice my singing before I can come back. <laughs> That's right. We have an audition. <laughs> Thanks for your uh, eternal encouragement, Karen. Blessings to you, Katika and Dan. Good night, Dennis. Uh, do you remember Shelly Peterson? She yes. says hello oh, to you. Oh, hi, Shelly. So Shelly's actually one of those same people. She was yeah. in my confirmation class years and years ago. And no, that, that's her mom. No, Shelly. This is not. This is not her mom. This is. Okay. The, yeah. I'm pretty sure. I don't think so. <laughs> we can fight it out later. We could. Hi, yeah. Beth. Uh, good night, Kadar. Good night, Robin and Dan. Blessings to you, Joanne and Ron. Joanne and Ron, we traveled with in Israel. Mm -hmm. uh, peace, Rose and Dave. Pam and Marlo, blessings night, to Pam. you. Good night, Marlo. Good night, Tyler. Good night, Tyler. <laughs> Good night, Sheila and Rosaria, buenas noches. Good night, Jean. And Marion. Good night, Joe and Barb. We had a great turnout tonight. Blessings to you, Lindsay. 
I mean, you might have to come back every night. Everybody shows up when you're... <laughs> I think that's everyone. Good night, friends. And you're right about Shelly. Her mom's name is Bev. There you go. See? Yeah. <laughs> night, friends.